If you want to enjoy high quality audio over Bluetooth, you're going to need a source device like a phone and a pair of headphones or earbuds that support a high quality Bluetooth codec. Fortunately, LDAC exists. For those of you who are unfamiliar, LDAC is a Bluetooth codec developed by Sony that enables higher transmission rates and therefore higher quality audio streams over Bluetooth. Better quality than using the standard SBC or AAC Bluetooth codecs. If you own an iPhone, you unfortunately don't get to use this codec because it's just not compatible. But if you have an Android phone, then there is a high likelihood that your phone actually does support LDAC. And if that's the case, then you've come to the right video because in this video, I'm going to be giving you two of the best headphones and two of the best earbuds that support LDAC. Starting with headphones, if you want higher quality audio over Bluetooth but don't want to spend a fortune, then I've got a pick for you that's under $80. That is the Edifier W830NB. Now for less than $80, these headphones offer a really impressive feature set. For starters, they have active noise cancellation. It's not class leading by any means, but it's gonna be more than enough for daily commutes. It has pretty good sound quality, again, for the price. Although if you're not entirely happy with the tuning, you can of course take advantage of the Edifier app and just use the equalizer to tune the headphones to your liking. Of course, since it's in this video, these headphones support LDAC, so you can get those higher quality audio streams over Bluetooth. And if the battery does die or you just don't don't want to use a wireless connection, you can of course listen with the headphones using USB-C audio, which is really neat and a feature that you don't often find on headphones under $100. It's actually a feature you don't find in some headphones that cost over $300. Looking at you, Sony XM6. So again, don't want to spend a fortune, but still want LDAC support? There you go, Edifier W830NB. Try saying that fast three times. W830NB, W830, uh, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Now, if money is kind of no object or you're just looking to invest in a pair of headphones that will last you a while and support LDAC, then our best overall pick is, no surprise, the Sony WH-1000XM6. After all, Sony was the company that developed LDAC. But besides having support for this higher quality Bluetooth codec, the XM6 headphones also boast impressive active noise cancellation, reducing the loudness of outside noise by an average of 87%, according to our testing. On top of that, it has pretty good sound quality, it has really good app features, including a very comprehensive and customizable equalizer. And the app even offers a find your EQ tests, which will cycle through different EQ options to help find the best tuning for your ears or according to your preferences. Also comes with Sony 360 reality audio support, sound virtualization. The headphones can cycle through different ambient sound presets depending on your location. And for the moments where you don't wanna use a wireless connection, you just need something with minimal to no latency, then you can also just connect wired to the headphones via the 3.5 mil jack. Now I won't lie to you, these headphones do cost more than just a pretty penny, maybe about four pretty pennies or more. But if you are looking for a great overall flagship, this is definitely worth considering. We've done a full deep dive review on these headphones and you can check that out right here. Okay, let's say you need something a little bit more portable then you're probably looking at earbuds. And here I've got two options for you here, best budget option and best overall option. For the best budget option, I'd highly recommend checking out the Anchor Soundcore Liberty 4 NC. Now these earbuds are not the newest on the market. They've been succeeded by different versions like the Liberty 4 Pro and the Liberty 5. But honestly, Anchor is still selling these earbuds and there's a good reason why. They're still damn good for the price. Again, these earbuds do support LDAC, so you do get those higher quality audio streams over Bluetooth. But beyond that, for under $100, these earbuds still have very impressive active noise cancellation performance. And our lab tests show that these earbuds can reduce the loudness of outside noise by an average of 84%, which is really, really good, again, for less than $100. On top of that, they have a pretty decent sound. I mean, they are a little more bass heavy than I personally like, but the good news is that if you're not a fan of this tuning, you can customize the earbuds as tuning in the Anchor Soundcore app. It has a really good customizable EQ tool. Highly recommend checking it out and using it if you buy these earbuds. You've also got things like a hearing test, sound quiz, and they're just a really solid pick for less than $100. And the best part is that we often find these earbuds go on sale throughout the year for even less money. So yes, the retail price is $99.99, but during Black Friday and Prime Day, you can find it for around less than 80 bucks or even cheaper, depending on the time of the year. So if LDAC is your thing and you need a pair of earbuds that have LDAC, but again, don't wanna break the bank or just wanna find the best bang for buck, these earbuds are a really good option. Now, 
let's say you wanna you wanna treat yourself a little bit more. You want something that's a little bit more flagship-like. Well, take a look at the Nothing Ear 3. At the time of making this video, these earbuds are relatively new, but they do pack a pretty impressive set of features for less than the cost of the Sony XM5 earbuds, less than the AirPods Pro 3, and less than the Bose QuietComfort Ultra earbuds second generation. First of all, they've got a really unique design. They've got this nice transparent design that nothing is known for. Looks really cool, definitely stands out, and is just nice to look at. Earbuds are pretty comfortable in the ear, according to our testing and review. The earbuds, of course, support LDAC. That's why it's in this list. But I gotta say, my favorite feature about these earbuds is the app. The Nothing X app is one of the best headphone companion apps out there, mainly due to the fact that it has a customizable parametric equalizer, which really lets you go in and dial in the tuning of the earbuds to your taste. Like you can actually adjust things like the Q band, the exact frequency you want to adjust and the gain. And it actually tells you how each of the bands are being adjusted. It's not just some vague bass mids treble slider. I mean, there is that option if you just want to go simpler with your tuning. But for the advanced users out there or people who really just want to get down and dirty with like the frequency and the actual numbers, yeah, nothing actually trusts you to, to play with the earbuds as you will. But beyond that, there's also other features like a hearing test, which will adapt the earbuds based on your amount of hearing loss with your ears. We've also got things like bass enhancement, low latency mode, control customization. There's just a lot you can do with these earbuds for not too much money, especially when you're comparing it to flagships from like Bose, Sony, and Apple. Coming at just under $180, the Nothing Ear 3 really is a compelling buy and definitely worth checking out if you are specifically looking for earbuds that have support for the LDAC codec. Of course, I'm just kind of skimming through the features of the Nothing Ear 3. So if you want a deeper dive into these earbuds before you go all in to the $180 price tag, then I highly recommend checking out my colleague Adam's review of the earbuds right here. It's a pretty good review. Go check it out. It's, come on. It looks good. Look at that thumbnail. You want to click on that thumbnail. That's going to be that's going to be good. Trust me. You're going to have a good time here. Click.